Right, big news here on Rahul Gandhi, who's just reached Manipur, the strife town Manipur, where he's going to be visiting three violence hit districts of Manipur. Rahul Gandhi visits a relief camp set up at Jiri Bam in Manipur. Visuals coming in of Rahul Gandhi, who's just arrived in Manipur at this point. You know that Rahul Gandhi has been firing at the center, the BJP, the Prime Minister particularly, saying that. Uh, and the Congress saying that Prime Minister Modi has decided to go off to Russia while Rahul Gandhi has ma visited Manipur thrice so far. Now, yet again, we're looking at Rahul Gandhi arriving into Manipur where he's going to be visiting some violence stone areas, three areas which was hit by violence in the recent past. He's going to be visiting those relief camps. And those are the images of Rahul Gandhi's arrival into Manipur, the leader of opposition. Rahul Gandhi, for the first, soon after the elections, visiting Manipur and relief camps in Jiri Bam, Churachandpur and Moirang. This is his day-long visit in some of the strife tone areas. Also scheduled to meet with the governor, Anasuya, at 5.30 p.m. Indrajit joining us for more on that. Indrajit, take it, take it away on Rahul Gandhi's visit to Manipur. Uh, he is visiting some of the strife tone areas. And, uh, who has he arrived with? Is there a whole battalion that he's come with or he's come alone what kind of security any restrictions that he has in his movements do tell us more well uh, Nabila, this is the third time that rahul gandhi has come to manipur uh, ever since uh, uh, the uh, ethnic strife broke out in the state and this is of course the first time after the election results have been announced so it's very very important because it comes in the backdrop of the leader of the opposition raising the manipur issue in Parliament, you would remember, in his uh, maiden speech as the leader of the opposition. So Rahul Gandhi begins his uh, trip from Jiribam. So he first went, landed in Assam in Sinchar. From there, he went to Jiribam. And he met, uh, you know, uh, uh, people at the relief camp there, at the Hamar relief camp. From there, he will now, uh, he's reached the Sinchar airport. He will be flying uh, to Insal now, uh, later in the afternoon. And he would be then uh, proceeding to Chura Chantpul, which in a sense, in many ways, it was the epicenter of the entire ethnic strife in Manipur. That's where uh, most of the Kuki population uh, lives. So he will meet the Kuki community in Churachanpur. And then on his way back to Impal, he would go to Bishnupur district, where he would go to a Miti relief camp and meet uh, victims, uh, Miti victims uh, from the Miti community. Uh, in Manipur. Uh, in the evening, he would also be calling upon uh, the governor of Manipur. And finally, uh, he will uh, he is likely to speak to the media, hold a press conference in the evening. Very, very crucial because this comes, as I said, right in the backdrop of the opposition and uh, in specific, the Congress party and Rahul Gandhi as the leader of the opposition raising the Manipur issue, upping the ante against the Narendra Modi government, saying that the Prime Minister has not been able to make time out to meet the victims of the Manipur crisis. At this point in time, we know that the Prime Minister is on a visit to Russia. Uh, however, the opposition parties are saying that uh, it's misplaced priorities of the Prime Minister and therefore the leader of the opposition has yeah. uh, decided to come to Manipur on a one-day trip. Thanks very much, Indrajit, for joining us.